points as he was a former contracted Coyotes player. Back down. It's actually the Oilers on the kill. Excuse me. As a one-time blast, they score. It's Polino. He gets his team leading third of the season. And it is one nothing Since he feed loose in front. Great defensive play by Hilderman. Millette. It's a three-on-two through center ice. Millette. Left circle. Backdoor feed. Finds Farron in front. A shot. What a save by Limbaugh. It's in. Following up on the up the campaign here at home in 2023-24. It's 1-1. Oh, Andy Carroll finishes. What was it, Zach? A second chance. Finally generated here in transition. It's Reggie Millette. He brings a lot of fire. He's a fresh guy. He didn't have a lot of ice time last weekend when he is on the ice. We've said it again. He's expected to be fresh and ready to go. A lot of burst along the left wing side. A great pass into the skate of a teammate. Dot, especially in game one in particular, he was really good. This shot from the point goes in. Boy, Cincinnati finds a seeing eye. Look. It was not much required on the timing. It's Andrusiak that finds the goal. He was an all-star last year. Picked his spot, let it go. And it's 2-1. The Oilers, after finding the evening goal, go down by one with about a decade of seconds left. And grabbing here is Cincinnati. Back to the Oilers line it comes. Touch pass down, left side, coming in. Folk backdoor feed, he scores! What a beauty of a goal! It's Dante Sheriff from Carson. Folk's second point of the night. And the Oilers have leveled the game with 18 33 left in the second. Well, looking back at training camp, somebody who had some of the best hands at camp are Carson Folk. His hands were fantastic. He was in Drusiak, up the wall, back up, right point, Legrone, chance shot, double block. Legrone seems it across, Watson on his offhand, centering feed, and it comes all the way across the face of goal. Now a chance, Carroll, a shot, he scores. That's tipped in front. I believe that'll belong to Calvin Watson. Uh, and the Oilers take their first. Comes just over two and a half minutes away from the midway mark of the game. Well, Doogie Legrone takes an initial shot. Legrone's the one who tries to send the puck to the net. Sure, it gets blocked. But the pickup in the corner again, right after that, allows that puck, well, to be in a space where there's no defense in front. Once that puck gets sucked back down low. He's not risking a play. Uh, to, to try to make a play he shouldn't be making, right? That's why I think he's almost unnoticeable. Oh, Here's Calvin here. Watson all alone in tight. It's in. Watson becomes the first shooter on the campaign to score multiple goals in a game. Calvin Watson, his second pulls up within two. Well, he was a really fun addition to this Oilers roster last year coming out of the college season ending. Once that college season ends, you get to pick up some guys. You get to look at some other types of players. Calvin Watson came in. He proved himself, played really well. Got himself a contract in Tulsa again this year. Made the team out of camp, and he has been dominant now. Now we can truly say he's...